I can be very honest with you. <laughs> the UN has continued to, you know, lay the proper notice of what it is to the zoology. And this is why I actually come in peace. Because those who come in peace understand the system. And by so doing, we can accurately tell ourselves the truth. That that very game they tried to change has now changed us. So why is the chase? It has been taken too far. And the miracle we all seek for is well planned. We must be wise in our quest to chase freedom. And when I say we have to be wise, even when the offers are being made to us, we have to understand why these offers are coming to us. Now, I love Prime Minister Simon Eber's speech in the, U, in, the United, in the United States Board, where everybody is now understanding that their friends were not cowards initially. We fought to defend our lands. That the zoo vowed to take from us. When they never succeeded, do they? No. They will never succeed. They has never succeeded. They can never succeed. So even though the game plan is changing, everybody is understanding that this whole scenario is working against the system of the zoo. And the earlier they understand this, the better for each or one of them. But as the game is changing so much that the recognition is being given in the whole circle, I must tell you, with every consideration that Biafrance has won this one last battle. This is one reason I must make my communication. So, as we push through understanding the system and making sure that nobody entails this very product, we must come together to support Sam Prime Minister Simon, but at least the enemies of their friends are already leaving gradually, gradually. And I'm the kind of told them that the more you keep fighting their friends, the more you set yourself up. They probably thought that Ahmadike was joking, but they never knew that that man is a spiritual man. A man who understands the system how the system should work, how the system should be productive, and how the system must be taken too far. If not, mistakes will be made. So I keep leaving it to them, that the people you fight today will eventually become your worst nightmares. And by then, most of you will be in search of your role models, which by that time you are not going to get any clue of what is happening. Let's support Prime Minister Simon Eba with all our hands. You know, see, you need to know the level of breakthrough that this young man has achieved internationally. He has achieved so much that the zoo do not have any other means but to cry their way out. 
ya wezo ka na agu no ana na elu melu ana na nko hiri ana na ka ju ba ju ju mata na gene bambo ndi ju vuru e motara asisa ana ndi ga ju kwa tata ke mota kwa asisa the truth has been exposed and each and every one of them can now agree to the system of what has become because when they say one good turn deserves another truly I tell you that this very good turn deserves more than another and they back eyes at all when you can kind of say again and Simon Eba is doing a, 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 a very very powerful work outside the walls of these countries we must be very focused if truly we want to achieve what is achievable if not we may end up not achieving anything at all. Yes. If you think that Simon Eba is not making progress, then you are a joker on your own. You know? You are a really, 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 really joker. In fact, it was you that the white saw and called you a really, really, really joker. From what is on the table right now, you will see that Simon Eba has already made a very, very strong point very very strong point doesn't matter how they try to twist the narrative what matters more now is that these people can now see that their friends are strongly ready to deliver what should be delivered so keep taking time but one thing is certain that victory did not just come from just sitting on one side and claiming to believe. So, as we push through this whole message and the continuation of what it is.